I know it looks like an average pass, but this whole pass set, it's so crucial. Passes like that. Because now look, you just gave... He could, have, he could have passed to Gundogan here, right? He could have passed to Gundogan there. But then Gundogan had to be in the right position with his angling. Or he would have to... Um, yeah, he would, or he would pass back, right? Because look... Look, he's facing towards Laporte. But if he's getting the ball from Sterling there, he can now position himself like that. That's perfect. Yeah, Belo, like these South Americans, it's just Grinta. They have crazy lungs. I don't know what is up with them. Belvedere is also in that, the bracket. And then that guy from Sporting you mentioned the other day. Because you know, boys, I realized that when I saw this clip. This, honestly, nature, this was a very, very nice clip. I liked it a lot. I, I, I think I watched this uh, in my free time. Guys, look at this clip. Look at this clip, boys. Look what he's saying here. While going out from the back to avoid the loss of the ball, you must create appropriate space to play further towards Eto. So he's actually saying you want to immediately play the nine from the from the center back. So he's giving the pass to Eto'o from the center back, okay, boys? If I'm gonna pass to Eto'o, the moment at this moment, this is the back look. So now he's showing them how the. There's an option to Deco, Iniesta. Look. So, so what he can do now, boys, he's getting the nine, right? Let me just show you. I, do you guys get this? Like, we are here all day, boys. We are apparently not sleeping today, so um, I'll, I'll show you. So what he's saying here, Pep... So what Pep... Oh, my days. Come on, what is this? Okay, there we go. Alright. So what Pep is saying is... There, there, and there. And there, there, and there. So... If you play 11 versus 0 training and you make your center back play there to Eto with the back to the goal, then now Eto can play here and he can play there, right? And these two players, these two players are facing their face is face forward, right? Like they're facing the game. So this is how you actually advance progression instead of if you played, if you played him here, then you would have to play back there, right? If you played there, then obviously you would have to play there. So if you play, or if you play there, he will play there, right? Like it's about using the furthest player. The, it's about using the furthest player as a, against the against the opposition, so he can just play it back. So now he's saying that when he plays to Eto, he has Deco and he has Iniesta. Deco and Iniesta is his two eights here. And now he's saying that if there are so many, if they do that in the follow, there's a tight space and they can counter press. Cruyff said to me and gave me this example When you have the ball, the first thing you need to do is to look as far as you can So Deco is passing to Marquez and now Marquez is not playing with Deco but is oriented on Eto'o Marquez is a center back, but I think this is a six, right? And it will give the ball back to Deco again, because he's facing... 
And this is and this concept of attack and defend is the best that exists. Tant per atacar com per defensar és el millor que hi ha. Jo us us ho dic jo, eh, la paret és defensable, pel tercer home indefensable. És el millor que hi ha. Jo us us ho dic jo, eh, because the one two is rather easy to defend against. És defensable, pel tercer home indefensable. But the third man is impossible to defend against. Mirau com rebia la pilota l'altre, mirau, tenia la Now he's now he's going into body positioning. Look how you how, how you get the ball in correct positioning with your body, boys. You see, like he's not. Look how he's look how he's creating separation here. And then he's opening his body. That's so nice. Imagine imagine like so many don't know this and like these players just naturally did this. Instead of instead of playing like that. He cannot see anything because he has poor body positioning and a body angling. I think this is also what he's telling Raheem here. Yeah, he's telling the Raheem the same thing. So many details. So many details in the sport, boys. We can't. To nine, but you see this combination, boys. We, did you see what we talked with Pep? Pass it to the furthest man. Jorginho passing it to Mer Mertens here, right? Set to the eight. You see? Now we got the eight, and now we can progress again. But this was a stupid pass from Hamzik. But you see, this is what Pep was talking about in the video. Six to nine to eight. Pep's football is more. Uh, I think. I think it would say it's more um, advanced. Like it's 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 more intelligent than this. This Cruyff, What you can do here, actually, you can just if you are intense in your man marking, you can completely kill a Sarri team. <laughs> 